Thank you, everyone. And yes, just like our officers have said, the movies really do have it shows us perspective. And my perspective personally has really changed on current issues because when we, we it shows us perspective that we don't even know is happening because this is reality. We don't just watch entertaining movies, we watch eye-opening and lightning movies. And so it opens perspective and when perspective are open, we understand what's really happening in the world. And because of that, it actually makes me more thankful for the privileges that I have that, other, that others do not have. It really makes me feel empathy and makes me want to be more evolved in my community so I can help people who are really going through these tough situations. Thank you. Oh, I'm so glad that how the movie they changed your perspective. So do you think like this documentaries can have a power to change all the people perspective as well? Yes, I do. I believe that this initiative, the movie nights, really do have the power to change the world because mostly I think the most important thing is shows us perspective. And when perspectives are seen and understood, we know the problems in this world that people are facing, which we might not actually be facing because we're not in that situation, or which might not be portrayed so much on the media. And so when we see these perspectives and we see the problem in this world, we will think of solutions of how to tackle and solve all these problems. And when we think of solutions, it doesn't have to be a big solution that tackles problem all at once. It can be a bit by bit and we can develop from there. And just like that, we can get to solve these problems. So yes, I do think it, can, it has the past change world positively. I do agree with you, Matt. Um, she touched a good point about like how it changed. Uh, not at, at this, like everything is going to change at once, but it is by steps. And you have to, to understand that. Like even when we are so eager to change the entire world, we have to start like just looking on our sides and seeing like how we can change. And it's very important because something that I noticed is that if we change with just like watching movies and a, a community of the students, I cannot imagine how big is this when it's viral. Like a lot of people watch these documentaries and a lot of people is just being touched by them. So. If we started changing our minds since we are young, I think we are going to be strong in our adulthood and we are going to keep uh, giving that change uh, to our communities. And this is important. I think everyone can change the perspective. And this is a reminder every time that we watch to that our society needs to change. And I love having those reminders. Thank you both for sharing. So we spoke about changing perspectives, but our main goal is always to provoke actions and real change in our communities. So can you share, Natalia, how movie nights have encouraged you to participate in related activities that promote social change? Um, I will say that I... <laughs> When I went to the movies, I felt so identified with some of them. And I started thinking, I feel in that position. I feel that I was part of that movie. Um, even though when my the members, they didn't know me, I was able to share my opinions, what I was thinking, what I was going through, even when it was so hard. But I, I thought that I needed to speak a lot. And then that gave me this, the... I don't know, like the, I, I felt strong enough and say, okay, I already had identified this problem, but I need to do something to change it. I need to do something. And so I became a peer mentor at my college and now I'm helping students that go to a transition and they want to, they feel uncomfortable um, because they come from other countries and they don't know the, the transition and they feel frustrated. And I feel them, I feel, I felt the emotions and um, I like the way that I can help and movie nights helped me to encourage me to be that change. Even my neighborhood, I volunteer a lot and I just like to do that, to know that I can be that light in the middle of someone's darkness and they, they then will be encouraged to help other people. 
Thank you. We love to hear about how movies have really changed your lives and see how you guys have really implemented them into your lives. So thank you for sharing your experience, Natalia and Nama. Now we'll go on to Rohan, who will really show us how it works. So first, I would like to share one video. Uh, Aditya, can you upload it? Yeah, can you share it? Can everyone see it? Yeah. Just let me know when you can, like, if you, you are not able to hear. Sure, sure. I'm so sorry. Look, she's been crying non-stop. She has a temperature of 105. I don't know what to do. No, I'm be parolas the sun. No, please. Just every time I hear her, she throws up. I don't know. Be parolas the sun. What are you saying? Can you just look at her? Yeah. No, she's burning up. Just you know. Be parolas la anglan. What? She's burning up. Feel her head. Tranquilly. 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 Can I check? Um, the Monday is Askan. What is he doing? What's... Do you have? Oh, my my baby, she's got a temperature of 105. She every time I feed her, she throws up. Please, just, can you? Let us get a word to her eyes. She's burning up. Feel her head. No rapid, uh... Please, just just please just feel her head. Feel her head. Feel her head. Just someone let me in to see the doctor. Oh, does anyone understand what I'm saying? Please, someone help me. Eight percent of U.S. citizens speak limited English. Yeah, no, complete opposite. Men in America. Professional interpreters can mean the difference mm -hmm. between life and death. Hi, everyone. I'm Rohan Nave, uh, co-president of Upsilon Gamma Chapter, uh, and I'm very sure that after watching this video, some of us or most of us will be having some sort of emotions, and emotions like sadness, maybe anger, frustration or even confusion. Well, let me tell you this, uh, it's very normal to feel such emotions, but what's not normal is that there are so many issues which are being unnoticed by us as a community, state, and country. Uh, in our chapter, our focus was to address such issues so that our members and even our fellow uh, friends from our college actually contribute in changing the world positively. My mom always tells me that if you wanna change world, first start doing by at home. And I believe in her because uh, countries are not formed by land, by huge land masses, but it, or nor by the union of state, but it is formed by local communities. When local communities come together, they can form state and even country. Uh, in our, I know that in our, uh, due to this pandemic, it was very hard for us to do go out and uh, do something good. But I feel that most of us will think uh, this is a weakness because it is a virtual reality in which we all are living. But uh, we see it as a strength because now we can reach so many people. As a matter of fact, that today we have hundreds of people watching us live. So I think it is still our strength. Uh, one of the good thing about uh, our chapter was that we as a student come together and we thought that we must let ideas freely flow. And that's why we are building characters over here. And we all must agree that building characters is equal to building nation. After watching the Capital Deadly Riot, we all must understand that building character is important because in our democracies, every voice must matter. And we just have to make sure that it is counted. In the end, I have time pressure now. So I will just say that uh, we all have heard from our childhood that when there's a will, there's a way. Uh, in our chapter, in our college, we just try to implement those things in our daily life. And I hope that we do great and we achieve best for us and for our community. Uh, that's all I have to say. And thank you so very much for listening to me. And I hope you all have a very good day. All right. So like before I like, end in this and let uh, Aditya end and in this, uh, I have a few questions about for you guys. So like as we have asked the question during the our, our Friday movie night. So what do you think about the movie, uh, about the clip? Is that impactful? Like, how do you think about that? Do you have any opinion on that? Anyone can start. 
or you if you want to so if you try and you want to put in the chat please do that we will uh, modify the chat post actually i have something to say about that um i just think that the whole concept is just really brilliant and how you're using like these films to just like really talk about this kind of awareness and these kind of issues that are going on in our country and how all this is going on especially with with these things that are happening to these people of a specific race, like like how a white man is commits this crime and gets four years for it, and how a black man commits the same crime but gets a longer prison sentence, and like like that's just not that's just not right. That's not equality and it just really motivates it's just really motivational to just really bring about the change that we need right now and it just motivates me to just want to be that change so that's all i want to say <laughs>